She's about to come up, and the other one is hot in high heels. Good to see Jason Jay go back in the saddle on race day. He rides number two, Etonian, in the last. On the outside is at 48 and 10. So the last couple, hot in high heels, and Coach Cheese. Favourite on the toad is number one, Divine Duke, at 440 and 180. Sam Weatherly aboard. They're set to go, gates open in the last, they're off. Etonian was back at the hop and settling back also. Is Piazza and uh, well back near the uh, tail of the field is Miss Pareto. Now the first away, De Margo Fontaine shows how Trigger is right there and Picnic Bay uh, pushes forward out deeper, followed out by Volts who looks for cover just in behind the leading division. A length away next is the favourite Divine Duke and on the inside of it as they settle down as Cochise, they work onto the course proper, 1100 metres to go. Two lengths away, hot and high heels with heartbeat. Uh, back midfield along the inside is Piazza, then Rod Maher, followed by Miss Pareto. One length away, Accolades back third last here with Etonian and Master Poet. They compress ranks now as they head down towards the 850 metres and taking over Picnic Bay. Leads by three quarters from Dame Margot Fontaine. Volts is right there, so is Trigger. Uh, then followed round by Rod Maher. Etonian off and around the Mount Deeper, followed on the, on the inside of those next by Cochise. Divine Duke, the favourite, got back to be midfield, but only four lengths off the leaders in a compact field. Then came Master Poet, Heartbeat, Piazza locked away on the inside as they come towards the home turn. Hot and high heels is off and around the Mount Deeper, and back near the tail of the field, Accolades and Miss Pareto. Into the straight they come now, 300 to go, De Margo Fontaine the leader. From on the outside is Volts wider out, hot and high heels, and behind these, Trigger getting out now and is coming after them. Down to the 150, De Margo Fontaine, Tackled now by on the outside, hot and high heels. Heartbeats running on, so is Volts, but it's still Dame Margot Fontaine in front, and it's going to win. Dame Margot Fontaine won it from hot and high heels. Third at the line was Heartbeat, and then Divine Duke out wide. Close up also was Volts, Trigger, and Piazza followed in behind those as they went across the line. Next was Cochise, Master Poet. Then came Miss Pareto, Rod Maher, further back Etonian. Uh, with that also would have been Accolades and Picnic Bay back near the tail of the field. Number 11, Dame Margot Fontaine at $7.40 and $2.40. In the Fortuna, Dame Margot Fontaine syndicate uh, ownership a group there in the Fortuna colours. And another one for the Ultridge Richards team, Matt Cameron at his busy best aboard at Dame Margot Fontaine, the filly by High Chaparral. Second will be Hot and High Heels. Heartbeat's been a nice run. That'll take third. And out wide, Divine Duke close up with it also was uh, Volts back in behind those. But number 11, Dame Margot Fontaine in the frame for the last. Yep, she stepped it up from her maiden win last time out at New Plymouth and she's been able to take out the 65 over the mile. Here's Result the numbers. Race 10, Matter Matter Tire Surfaces 1600. The winner 11, Dame Margot Fontaine. Second 12, Hot and High Heels. Third was three, Heartbeat. Fourth one, Divine Duke. Fifth, eight volts, and sixth, six.